Okay, I'm here at uh, Florida uh, Public Archaeology uh, Network, and it's got a long www.flppublicarchaeology.org. And uh, I'm here with uh, Della. And uh, Della, um, how long has archaeology been in Florida? Oh, for thousands of years. We've had people in Florida um, as early as 12, 14,000 years ago. And so archaeology has been going on for as long as people have been interested in the past. And what have you been finding lately underwater? Well, a lot of our work is done, uh, in, uh, of course, off the coast of Florida. And uh, we're from Pensacola, actually. We're affiliated with the University of West Florida. Uh -huh. And West Florida's got some fantastic shipwrecks in the bay there at Pensacola, including some early Spanish shipwrecks dating from 1559, part of an early colonial fleet that's wrecked in a hurricane. And so the university's been working on those ships as well as some other vessels today. Now, if you find any gold coins on those wrecks, do you get to keep any? Absolutely not. No, oh. it's, uh, but there's, there's no gold on these wrecks. They were colonization vessels. They were bringing people and material and equipment and supplies to establish a colony. And so, unfortunately, the colony failed. Uh, but all of these shipwrecks there are the property of the state of Florida, and the university is, uh, has got a permit from the state to excavate the vessels, and so it's all done uh, archaeologically. Now, if they failed, how come so many people speak Spanish in Florida? <laughs> Those are later people that came, but, uh, but if that see. colony had succeeded, we might all be speaking Spanish. But another 400 years from now, we'll be diving and looking at their wrecks, too. Well, that could very well be the case, absolutely. Cool. So, so if they want any inf more information on archaeology in Florida, Please do come by our booth for booth number 617 here at DEMA and visit our website, flpublicarchaeology.org, and we've got all kinds of information on archaeology in Florida, uh, especially underwater archaeology and shipwrecks. Wow, it sounds like you've said this before. I plus, have, which is why. Plus you have all the uh, brochures that they can uh, look at, um, as uh, all the different places. I know I've looked at those That's brochures correct. quite yes. a uh, bit. These are Florida's underwater archaeological preserves, and they're historic shipwrecks around the state that have been interpreted especially for divers and you know, you guys have been really lucky to have so many wrecks in one place. Absolutely. And uh, Florida, you know, it sticks out. It's a maritime crossroads, and it's kind of a ship trap. So we've got uh, wrecks from all, all periods of time here, as well as prehistoric sites. So they can come down, see the wrecks, and also play on the beaches. Exactly. What more could you want? Beautiful Thank you. things to see, yes. Thank you.